Here's a video explaining how to interpret these green, orange, and red bars in Ruskin. So I've simulated a CTV here and sampling continuously 24 seven at two Hertz with LTC batteries inside, your deployment is limited by battery life. So this is telling you that after 74 days, your batteries will run out. However, this orange section is telling you that even though the batteries are ran out, you still have 231 days of memory left inside the logger. This battery life estimate is actually fairly conservative. It's assuming that we're deploying in about five degrees Celsius seawater. So if it's actually closer to say 15 degrees Celsius seawater, you might get 80 days or 90 days out of the deployment. In that case, let's say you can't get out after 74 days, I don't know, due to some global pandemic, for example, then your logger will keep recording because you actually have plenty of memory left. So you might be able to fill up a few more days of memory. The other side of this is actually if you fill up the memory first. So let's say we sample at 32 hertz. In this case, I didn't change the batteries or anything. Now we're good for 19 days and it's not a battery here anymore. It's a memory chip telling us that after 19 days, our memory is filled up. And even though there's 55 days left of battery life, you're not gonna be able to get any more data on it because the memory is filled. And that's why this section is red. This is a hard stop. Once the memory is filled up, there's no way to get more data onto it without downloading and resetting up the logger.